Now, one of the uh, biggest things I see that people do making a mistake with how they load their mesh roller is this. I'll put the top one in first. You always want your mesh roller to go up and over and down, okay? And there's a reason for that, and I'm going to show you. I'm going to load one backwards just so you can see why it's such a big deal. <clears throat> and I've got pins in them. And have you ever wondered um, why I put the pin, um, the, the magnet, in with the rings and stuff that I gave you? Um, because a lot of people use pins. I'm loading this one backwards, okay? This one, I'm loading this way, which is backwards. You want to load them up and over this way. But I'm going to load it backwards just so you can see why it's backwards. Okay. Just going to put it at this angle right here. Now what you do is you take your mesh and you run it down under the ruler. Mesh is really curly. And when it comes off of that roll, uh, it's probably hot. Um, Cut straight off the, the machine when they put it in the roll. But I want to show you something. You pull this out, see what happens? See how that rolls back up on you? And you need a weight? This is not the way the mesh roller was designed to help you. Now, let me put it in here, because I see people doing this all the time and they're holding it down and they're putting paper weights on them. It defeats the purpose of having a mesh roller, okay? So look here, I'm going to roll it back up, I'm going to turn it around, and I'm going to load it in correctly, and now we're going to go down and under the ruler, and my son works very hard, y'all, to make sure that's a nice, smooth transition, but look here, it doesn't curl. So you get it lined up with your cutting mat and just say you need this many inches and you put it on the end of your cutting mat so you can use your inches and stuff. But y'all, don't load your mesh backwards. Load your mesh correctly because this is going to save you so much time, so much frustration. And the reason why with the mesh rolling up and curling up on you while you were working with, is why I came up with the idea of the mesh roller to begin with. So it was like, ah, it's so frustrating. And I see people uh, doing it and it's just like, oh, bless their heart, if I could just come through the screen and tell them they have it backwards. <laughs> so please spread the word. It goes down over, which is the way I think Everybody is kind of debatable how toilet paper should grow up and over and down and under. Now, I do put instructions inside each box. Now, a lot of people may not see that, but uh, I do have instructions on how to load these.